if ever there was a time to celebrate the brilliance of Welsh film and television, it's right now. Heno, but then an Andra de the Ain Henwebion and Henichwir. On but then he heavy de Mindachi or Dyth and Nigru, true to Widian screen, a man Hemri, or the Nidathli Gwaith, a rising Kavrani at Deviant and Tirweth Credigal Kamreg. Kreuzer, welcome to the 30th British Academy Cymru Awards. Noswetha, I'm Alex Jones, your host for this evening. And we've taken over BBC Cymru Wales Central Square Studios to stream the award ceremony to screens globally. It's been an exceptional year for film and television in Wales. And when it comes to choosing what to watch, well, we've been spoilt for choice. Television drama has never been better. And nominees this evening include talent across hit shows such as It's a Sin, Gangs of London, The Pembrokeshire Murders, His Dark Materials, Industry, In Boromarcher, Keeping Faith and A Discovery of Witches. In a category of faith yields, and anybody can in Harwain can a dour or bathe gar, or to the new Rani Strayon can a chwilier hin, a minor lagi evod in the ekin gemreg, a brudre etimonio valduis, taith anno the personal fruit londib dinion, or effi finistriol, gash clevid crones galer a rising beuger or kevlurma. Our acting categories are bursting with first time BAFTA nominees, including Callum Scott Howells, Alexandria Riley, Keith Allen and Andrea Doherty, all of whom are sharing the spotlight with those who are more than a little familiar with being nominated. Mark Lewis-Jones has received his seventh actor nomination. And when it comes to Michael Sheen and Dame Judi Dench, well, frankly, we've lost count of how many nominations they've racked up between the two of them. However, as BAFTA's motto goes, it's not about the numbers, it's the excellence that counts. Bechi gydewchyn i'n gael cipolwg ar yr emwebiadau. Rock and roll, man. Cool. Fantastic. Now, to present the awards this evening, I'll be joined in the studio by some incredible talent. Airy Thomas, Helleth Gwynn, Sean Daniel Young, Rick Yayola, Amir Wilson, Ben Azakar, Mihala Herald and David Johnson. And for those who aren't quite ready to reveal themselves from the waist down, we'll be joined remotely by Shopee Dirisu, Matthew Rees, Amelia Jones and Anton Deck. Pirching Hovio, you can join us online via the BAFTA Cymru social channels as well as downloading your own digital copy of the awards brochure. Now, to, in a time honoured tradition of two years, I get to present the first two awards this evening, the first of which is for single documentary. Bitham Gumri Golog at Saul Gavadi and Webby. Black and Welsh. I am the first black Rastafarian beekeeper in Wales, to my knowledge. Did I think I could be it? No. 
I seen it as something what middle class white people do after they retire. We're all a human one race, but because of structural racism, the tools of opportunities are unfairly distributed. Critical coronavirus in intensive care. Like this, like half an hour or so before I start going, and like I can feel my heart racing a little bit more. It's just taken me about 10 minutes to find my shoes. It's recording. This is the before the second cup of coffee face. Got coronavirus, and it's just frustrating not being on the front line. My face is starting to hurt quite a lot now. My name is Rod Gilbert. Rod Gilbert, stand up to infertility. To be. Except it's not all going to plan in my family planning clinic. The uh, sample pot is uh, here. I suffer from a condition called shit jizz. Got some uh, materials. Apparently, shit jizz is common amongst men. But we don't want to talk about it because we're men. I got to one night, and I think it was three, three, four o'clock in the morning. I was just covered in sick, and I was just, I'd had enough. And I rang my parents and said, I'm going. Strictly Amy, Crohn's and me. I said to them, I can't do this anymore. I was just in so much pain. I said, I'm done. I can't fight this anymore. And the first BAFTA Cymru Award of the evening goes to Strictly Amy, Crohn's and Me. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. You have no idea what this means to me. And also a big thanks to producer Laura, Wild Flame, and of course the amazing, incredible people who are so brave and shared their stories. Hopefully this has helped fellow sufferers, their families, work colleagues, and most importantly, helped raise awareness for one day a cure. Thank you again. Our second award of the night is for sound. Dyma'r enwebiadau. Production team. Gangs of London. You see anybody's feet under the armors? You fucking shoot them, you hear me? Production team, his dark materials. The mother of all. Please answer my next question, yes or no. Have you reached a verdict on which you're all agreed? Production yes. team, the Pembrokeshire murders. Counts? Yes. On count one of the indictment, the murder of Helen Thomas, do you find the defendant, John William Cooper, guilty or not guilty? Production team, Roald and Beatrix, The Tale of the Curious Mouse. Our initiative is production team for Gangs of London. Wow, thank you very much, uh, BAFTA Cymru, for uh, this prestigious award. Um, I'd like to thank uh, Pulse Films for um, allowing us to do the soundtrack on this wonderful Gangs of London series. And we'd really like to thank uh, Gareth, Corin, and Xavier, the directors, um, all the guys at Sky and AMC, and of course, uh, the full team and extended family of Bank Post Production. Dioch. Thank you, BAFTA Cymru. This means a lot. I'd like to thank and congratulate my team, Jason Devlin, Rory Hammond, and Miroin Lewis. I'd like to thank Ed Talvan, Gareth Evans, Pulse Films, and all at Sky. Dioch and Vario. Congratulations to our sound winner. Now to present the next awards are two actresses 
you wouldn't want to get on the wrong side of, who have almost certainly had their Woodland Trust membership cancelled. O gyfres bwblog the BBC, The Pact, croeso i Helleth Gwyn, a chyn yn ychydd yng nghategori actores BAFTA Cymru, Eiri Thomas. Well, hello ladies, chyn iawn. Hello. Diawn, diolch. Neis i weld chi. Diolch. I'm amazed we're presenting the children's programme with an introduction like that. <laughs> well, I've checked on the Gruffalo. It's all fine. So we're happy to have you here with us. I'm a guy who is a kid 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 who is Llong gyfer chi adau? Yeah. Um, Dewn ni draw at y tŷ nawr helaeth ar gyfer y wobr gyntaf. Diolch, Alex. And it's great to be presenting not one, but two awards. The first of which is for children's programme sponsored by Hugh James Solicitors. Beth am Gymryd Golwg ar y sawl a gafodd eu henwebu. Dayan Aloli. So how long have you been feeling like this? Jamie Johnson, outside the box. I don't know. When did you first realise you were gay? From the second I was born. No, seriously. I always knew I was different from as far back as I can remember. I didn't have a name for it or even understand what it meant, but in here, I just knew. Do you have any soil for a barbary view to have it and tell me who you got over every night? Mabinogi Ogi Amoy. Was that in Taligar as ever with? Oh, Timor Tenth. Massage! Never see Shenate. Die beth my ogi need and wish na name. Well, think it's no. All right, all right. Are you still there? Dayan Aloli. Woo! Oh, dear Chavarian Bafta, I'm a whopper Arbenigma. Thank you so much, Bafta, for this incredible award. So now look at the old Ishonet Roberts. I'm going to show you the rest. Ein uwch gynhyrchydd yng Ngharad Ellen, neris fy nghyd gynhyrchydd, maen o'n wyn am y sgript gwych, ein cynllunydd arbennig David Roberts, a Mirrain oedd yn ei gynorthwyo, diolch i Ellen am ein arwain trwy'r wythnos a hefyd gwyddfyd, i Lynn am warchod ein cast ifanc, diolch brengain am docholl waith caled ers y mynno efo ni, i aled ein dyn camera anhygoel, a heb siôn ein dyn sain sy'n neb yn clywad y gair rybyd i rew. I Yestyn a Becky am yr effeithiau arbennig, i Steve yn golygu'r talentog, i Owes am onlenio ac i Gavs a Dan am os oedd yr hynna'n olaf yn y dyb. Ac wrth gwrs, ein cast hollol wych, diolch o wylod calon i Rhian, Simon, Gwern a Lowry, Sara, Rhys, Ivan a Lleiki am ei perfformiadau anhygoel drwy ddidraw. Mi oedd creu y bennod arbennig yma yn brofiad byth gofiadwy ni gyd felly diolch yn fawr iawn bafta. Llong gyfarchiadau. And as if we're not being entertained enough, the next award is for Entertainment Programme, sponsored by Coain Mentera Business. Let's take a look at the nominations. Gonna be a lot to dan us, okay? Fab, cool! Am dro. Oes gyda'i le i bryderu? Beth eich chi, meddwl? Ar graf cyntaf fi yw, mae fe'n rhydd i llithreg, mae yna eira modd ma'n, a dwi wrth i ifanc i farw. Ia, fi'n dweud. O, rhew, 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 rhew. Fi'n meddwl fi wedi cael ei rhywbeth fel Switzerland neu Austria i fod yn onest. Fi'n sioct bod yr mynyddoedd fel hyn, ac mae yna'n rili oer. Beth eich chi, feddwl, o... Doleg a sgolni, mae'n inkla. Mae'n bwyd yn dweud. Dwi'n bwyd yn dweud. Dwi'n bwyd yn dweud. Dwi'n bwyd yn dweud. Rwy'n pes yn bath o fi a. Sydd mwn 
Cuckoo Crap, I carry a stone in one of them centuries as well. Centuries. Yeah, so they're both, they're both Chinese both. whispers, so I really do. I thought at least screw you over in there. Yeah, actually. Hmm. I feel like I'm more stunning and I'm all. Well, Taylor Bachney, isn't it? Taylor Bachney. Dathly Grangillis. Yeah. Priodas Pemil. Nath o weld i fam, a dysg weld hi'n edrych fel oddi, mor hapus. Oh, no, Ashley. Sorry, Bappy, do go on. Embarrassing, ja. Mae'n neis codd o ddyn a bochdi i y person ti ôl i magu, ond mae'n rai i fi ofyn. Os mae'n sa magu yma heno, man. Sut sa hi'n dod o'r sgwrs, mae'n ben? Wel... Sgwrs dan y lloer, Christopher Hughes. Pwys yna i dwi'n gystig yw? Ty dan i ti efo gin tan dan i methu pronuncio fo. Ar ennill i ddiw? Dolig ysgol ni, mae syncla. Diolch yn fawr iawn i chi, Bafta. Thank you so much, Bafta Cymru. Mae hyn wir yn anrhydda. This is such an honour. Sri Lwyd Cydiolch ar ran y tîm cynhyrchu i gyd yn crwmni darlun yn gynarfon yn arbennig Arwyn Evans a Gwian Maredydd Jones. Ac wrth gwrs, staff y sgwmau syncla i Elaine Llwyd am ddysgu plant rapio, i criw codi'r to am ddysgu ar canu, ac yn fwy na neb y plant, y ser i hunan, plant gorn y byd. Diolch yn fawr i chi. Diolch yn fawr i Eiri a Helev, and congratulations to our entertainment winner. Our next award, sponsored by Decade 10, is for writer. Mae'r ysgrifenwyr sydd wedi ein webu wedi llwyddo i wneud yn ei grio ar y sofa, cuddio tu o liglistog a werthu'n mas yn ei chelwythau i gyd ar yr un pryd. Brilliantly crafted words are long remembered and these nominees are some of the very finest wordsmiths. Let's take a look at their work. Geography. Mm -hmm. Where? Barry Jones, rubbish. Rampo. Nah, the am in club, I'm I don't know if I this spell you. I IQ with an honor sort of thing. It's a good I'm going to write it. I'm going to see you. 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 Gareth Evans and Matt Flannery, Gangs of London. Really, Alex? So this is who you are now? For today, at least, until we know who killed Finn and why. It doesn't suit you. Russell T. Davis, It's a Sin. I love you. It's about time. I was busy. Love you too. The BAFTA Cymru Award goes to Russell T. Davis for It's a Sin. Hello there and thank you BAFTA Cymru. That's lovely, that's a very great honour. Thank you very much and I'd really like to dedicate this to the people I think who do the real work, the people fighting and educating and now conquering HIV. Extraordinary work being done. Here's to them. Thank you. To present the award for television drama sponsored by Facilities by ADF are two presenters who had to switch three weeks in Australia for three weeks in North Wales. Currently rehearsing the revised line, I'm a celebrity, where are you two? It's Anton Deck. Thank you for inviting us to be part of the awards this evening. We can't wait to get back to Wales for the new series of I'm a Celebrity. Yes, thank you, Wales. All of Wales? Yeah, why not? All of Wales. Thank you, all of Wales. We're delighted to present the award for television drama. <gasps> we do love a good drama. We certainly do. All the classics like uh, Bush Took a Trial, the Celebrity Cyclone, the one where they push the celebrities out of the helicopters. Classic, classic, classic. drama. But thankfully, the ones nominated in this category have a little more depth. Depth. Mm -hmm. oh. Let's take a look at the nominated programmes. His Dark Materials. Is this your Oxford will? It is. Why 
Why are we whispering? I don't know. <laughs> Lure them in, young, worked into death. Industry. Fucking murderers! Party of devils! <laughs> don't don't move. We hear Mr. Flo. Save me, Rishi! Save me! <laughs> Eric, don't make my job tougher. The Pembrokeshire Murders. Today's verdicts give the families of Richard and Helen Thomas, Peter and Gwenda Dixon, and the five victims of the Knowlton Hill attacks and their families justice. But there is no sentence the court could have imposed on John William Cooper that could ever compensate them for their loss. Professor Reese has ruled out surgery as a viable option. The tumor's too inaccessible. Ian Boromercher, keeping faith. I think I should let him die in peace. They want to move him to palliative care. It has to be now or never, Mike. If you want to go ahead, I can file the application today. The BAFTA Cymru Award for television drama goes to... The Pembrokeshire Murders! A very big thank you to BAFTA Wales for awarding the Pembrokeshire Murders Best Television Drama. It was a hugely competitive field, so we feel greatly honoured to have won the award. It's testimony to a brilliant team who made the show, led by Ed Telfin, our producer in Wales, director Mark Evans, and writer Nick Stevens, who handled the dark and difficult story with great sensitivity. I'd also like to thank Luke Evans and Keith Allen, who led a brilliant homegrown Welsh cast in bringing the story to light. Well done to our television drama winner. Now, at the beginning of the show, I promised an exclusive journey through the screen industry here in Wales, and I'm not one to go back on a promise. Mae'r cyntaf o'n ffilmio byrion arbennig heno yn dathlu ac yn arddangos rhai o'r straeon sgrin anhygoel o'r deuddeg mis diwetha. From groundbreaking innovations to first steps in the industry, companies and individuals have risen the bar on productions and ensure they've put Wales firmly on the production map as one of the most creative, supportive and ambitious countries in the world. Er gweitha y ffeithiau parhaus y pandemig, mae hi wedi bod yn flwyddyn anhygoel i'r diwydiant ffilm a thaledu yma yng Nghymru. O gyfleoedd newydd, ymarfer arloesol, a dramau a oedd yn torri tu'r newydd i ddylladau unigryw, i llawer o straeon da ledled y wlad. Mi ddathlodd heno ddeng mlynedd ar hugen fel y rhaglen gylchgrawn Cymraeg heraf sy'n rhedeg. BBC Wales' hard-hitting consumer programme celebrated 20 years of helping viewers fight back against rip-offs, rogues and shoddy service. Mi ddathlodd dechrau canu, dechrau camol, drigain blynedd o ddarlledu. Many companies have been supporting and nurturing new talent through training programmes, funding and support schemes and increased job opportunities. My name's Ashra, I'm from Cardiff, I'm a student and a freelance photographer. So my film, In a Room Full of Sisters, is a spoken word short film about my Somali heritage and how one stays connected to Somali culture whilst living in Wales. My Cynllun Folio Film Cymru Wales ar gyfer ffilmiau byr wedi bod cefnogi talent creadigol yng Nghymru, o ddisgyblaethau y tu allan i'r diwydiant ffilm neu dyledu. I come from a challenging area in South Wales. Never thought I'd get my foot into this industry and now I'm working on one of the biggest TV shows at the moment. I got made redundant. Uh, I came across Screen Allowance Wales. I worked with them for a bit and then I became the health and safety manager for His Dark Materials season three. My journey started with me on reception for Wolf Studios Wales. I then became an assistant for Screen Alliance Wales and now I'm the studio manager at Paint and Practice, which is a digital art company. My Screen Alliance Wales wedi parhau i hyrwyddo a symuleiddio delwedd y diwydiant ffilm a thaledu i bobl ifanc trwy rhaglen hyfforddau ac addysg. Blacklight and Channel 4's drama anthology On the Edge was filmed across Wales and championed Welsh first-time writers and directors, as well as offering opportunities for crew to step up into new creative roles. Hyd ariannodd Esperarec a Chronfa Cynnwys Cynulleidfaodd Ifanc y BFI y gyfrinach, 
sef cyfres drama newydd gan Boom Cymru, a gefnogodd y greadigaeth o gynnwys y negryw i gynulleidfaodd hyd at ddeina oed. Mae'n stori llawn gobeth yn dylunio beth mae pobl yn gallu wneud pan maen nhw'n dod at ei gilydd a, um, a mae gyda nhw freiddwyd maen nhw'n ei wireddu a, a, a mae'n teimlo bod hwnna'n neges pwysig iawn yn enwedig ar y funud. Ond mae'n lot fawr o bobl lleol wedi, wedi bod yn rhan o'r ffilm um, a hefyd oedd gyda ni sgîm ffwt yn y dôr ar gyfer pobl sydd ddim ar y cyfan yn cael cyfleoedd i weithio'n y diwydiant ffilm. Um, fi'n gobeithio yn ymarferol bod y ffilm wedi rhoi rhywbeth nôl i'r gymuned. New funding schemes and investment through Cluster has enabled companies and individuals to carry out innovative research and development in new creative technologies. And opportunities will continue to increase as Media Cymru has won a £50 million bid to make Cardiff Capital Region a global hub for media innovation. This is a project that builds on the fantastic success that we've seen in Wales in media production uh, and the audiovisual industry. There's been huge growth in the sector over the last decade and what this project tries to do is to build on that success, capitalise on it, but sustain and develop it. My Tirwedd Godidog Cymru wedi parhau i denu cynrychiadau drama i'r blad, gyda nifer o raglenni rhagorol yn cael eu saethu ledled Cymru. I love working in Wales because it's home for me. This is where I've brought up my kids and my family live here. So you've got everything here. You've got the sea, you've got fantastic cities. Rivers, mountains, beautiful old buildings and countryside. Hearing Welsh in the workplace, I love it. I do, being able to say, Burda, and that is, that makes someone feel very much at home. Being surrounded by your own accents um, and languages and culture. With all the good things happening in film and television production in Wales, there's no doubt the industry will continue to thrive. Watching that has given me Michael Sheen levels of Welsh pride. Now to, to present the next two awards is an actress who has starred in many, many television dramas, including The Pact, Noughts and Crosses, Shetlands, No Offence, Doctor Who and Holby City. And earlier this year, won Best Supporting Actress at the Virgin Media British Academy Television Awards for her incredible performance in Anthony. Actress, producer and proud Cadiffian, my blesser Calcavluna, Ricky Ayola. Hello, Ricky. How are you? Hello. I'm very well, thank oh, you. Oh, it's great to have you with us. And I read that you dreamt of winning a BAFTA as a child. Is that true? It's absolutely true. I saw actors being given a trophy. And if you can think, at eight years old, a trophy is something you like to have and it didn't involve running or doing any cross-country. <laughs> <laughs> I thought, oh, I'd like one of those, please. And then age 53, so 45 years later, to finally get one was a bit overwhelming. Wow. And, thrilling. and the reality was as good as the dream. The reality was so good that as soon as I came off stage that day, um, I had to crouch down because I thought I'm going to fall over. I got so heady. I'm going to pass out. So I crouched down um, as if I was playing with my shoes and then I burst into tears. Oh. Anthony was such a powerful and important drama. What did you take away from that experience? Then? Oh, Alex, I took away what, what we lose, what people lose, what a mother loses, mm. what a community loses. Nobody wins. The people who, who commit crimes like that don't win. Their families don't win. Everybody loses something. And, and I think what Jimmy McGovern wanted us to see was what maybe what we'd lost, because Anthony really did want to be a lawyer. He wanted to be a civil rights lawyer. You know, that, that, wasn't, that wasn't fictional, that was no. fact. He wanted to be that. Um, and so we lost some, a, a, an incredible adult, actually, is what we lost. And his mother continues to grieve, as do his family. And that's what I took away from it, that you never get over this. No. Well, on a happier note, you're here to present a couple of awards for us this evening. So I'll hand over to you. Thank you. The first of the awards I'm presenting tonight is for Photography Factual, which showcases a diverse range of subjects from the history of Welsh art to life inside a coronavirus intensive care unit. 
It can be difficult to capture the astounding, the heartbreaking or historical, but the nominees tonight have produced some outstanding camera work in the category of factual programming. Let's take a look at the nominees. So it's three o'clock in the morning. Camera team, critical coronavirus in intensive care. Can you go and have a sit down and try and have a rest? Um, there is warning of one person out there on the wards um, who's doing okay, but might come our way. So we'll see how that goes later in the line. Do you think that everyone should speak Welsh in Wales? No. No, no, because that's our secret language. Emily Almond Barr, Black and Welsh. People perhaps won't look at me and think that's a Welsh speaker. I, well, I mean, in some situations, the assumption that I don't speak Welsh will be quite handy because I'll be able to eavesdrop, which me and my friends have done in the past. And we know that these guys were, of course, unfortunate and were trapped down here. Nathan McIntosh, Hidden good. Wales with Will Millard. Marks that are present on the cave wall. Whereabouts are they? You see these deep incisions. It's almost certainly these were last desperate attempts to get out. It's pretty bleak. <laughs> it's a bit, isn't it? <laughs> Danielle hopes to eventually uncover Ice Age animal bones. Tudor Evans, The Story of Welsh Art. The turn of the 20th century saw a revolution in the world of art. All across Europe, artists were challenging the academic traditions, experimenting with different styles to create something completely new. The BAFTA Cymru Award for Photography Factual goes to the camera team for Critical Coronavirus in Intensive Care. It is amazing to win an award by a team who has never held a camera before. The doctors, nurses, allied healthcare professionals behind the camera at critical coronavirus in intensive care were able to show what it means to be a critical care professional during the first wave of the pandemic. We would like to thank Luke Pavey at Folk Films and BBC Wales, whose faith was put in our work. And with that, we were able to tell our story. Thank you. Arwabur Nesav, sponsored by Channel 4, is for Factual Series. Creating factual content takes an outstanding ability to spot and tell a story which draws and hooks us into the life of the subject. And the nominees in this category did just that. Dyma Gipoluk. If I could take the essence of this school. A special school. Sell it with a book and a manual. I reckon I'd be a very, very rich man. Everyone, are you ready? It's about a lot of intangibles, really. It's about attitude. It's about relationships. Richard Lewis! <laughs> it's about unconditional love and unconditional acceptance of the children. Cornwall. This fishing life. Gotta keep battling. The fishermen of Cornwall. Really? Come on, lobster. For hundreds of years, they've worked some of the richest fishing grounds in the world. Got one. Cornish calamari. It's like a primeval thing, like Neanderthal man was doing it like thousands of years ago. We're still doing it now. Like. <laughs> Critical this inside intensive care. Unit in Newport's Royal Gwent Hospital. The whole point of intensive care is to buy time, and the way we buy time is by providing organ support. 12 beds, 12 lives hanging in the balance. Rod Gilbert's work experience. ...emotionally for being a carer, and sure enough, nothing had a had a had. This is making me quite emotional. Just 1% into the job, and watching carers and residents interact knocked me for six. At initiative view, Rod Gilbert's work experience. 
Cheers, BAFTA. I'm not sure if we won the other award, but we are still here in Cannes uh, celebrating. Thank you very much, Best Factual Series. Very nice. Thanks to my wonderful production crew, uh, Nath McIntosh, Sarah Allen, Sarah Breeze, Johnny Campbell, uh, Chris Caden. Thanks to BBC Wales for commissioning the series. Um, but most of all, on something like this, thanks to Cardiff Council for making it happen and to the wonderful care community, all the carers at College Fields Nursing Home and out in the community. Thank you for helping us highlight the wonderful, wonderful work uh, that you do on behalf of the whole team. Thank you very, very much. Thank you, BAFTA. Diolch Cheers. Congratulations to our Factual Series winner, Andy Reiki. Well, Moya was staying with Dikera the Nour, even Danny Truer category in Nessa. Joining us are two stars from stylish drama industry, which delves into the cutthroat world of investment banking. Please welcome Myhala Herald and David Johnson. Hello, both. How are you? Hey, Good, well. thanks. Thanks for agreeing to present some awards for us. Now, let's talk about industry, first of all, because, you know, I have trouble with the banking app on my phone. <laughs> but you two really needed to know your stuff for this drama, or so it seemed. How much research did you do, David? A, a decent amount. I think, you know, you have to kind of know what you're talking about, but how much of it stuck, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> are, you the, are you the SWAT in this partnership? I tried to be. <laughs> right. she, would, yeah. she would tell me soon enough. Okay. <laughs> what about you, Mahana? Um, yeah, yeah, I did. I did as much research as I could to the best of my abilities. Um, but there's so much about that world that mm. if you don't have, it's like a whole different language. Yeah. And I've given myself grace. I don't have to do my own baking. I don't have to. I don't have to trade. I don't even know basic math, if I'm honest. But as long as I'm convincing, as long as I'm doing my job, then then I think. That's good. <laughs> yes, both fantastic actors. So we don't need to worry about the banking world, well, thankfully. <laughs> um, we're going to come to you, David, for the first award when you're ready. Thanks, Alex. Thank you. So the next award for production design, sponsored by Sugar Creative, which celebrates the amazing skills and talent which go into creating the visual world of a film or television show. Let's take a look at the nominees' work. James North, A Discovery of Witches. Tom Pierce, Gangs of London. Tom Pierce, Rolls and Beatrix, The Tale of the Curious Mouse. Beatrix? The BAFTA Cymru Award goes to Tom Pierce for Gangs of London. I'd just like to thank the BAFTA Cymru and the selection committee. I'd like to thank Sky and everyone at Pulse with the Gangs of London. I'd like to thank my fantastic team, you know who you are. And finally, a huge thank you to Scott and Lindsay and all the guys and girls at Forward Construction. Congratulations to the production design winner. Our next award is for editing, sponsored by Gorilla. I always think editing as wizardry that magically brings a production seamlessly together. Editors are also the keepers of all of the mistakes and the dodgy takes, which you wouldn't want others to see. So note, be nice to editors. Let's take a look at the sorcerer's work in action. Al Edwards, critical really coronavirus in intensive care. Resourcefulness, the camaraderie and the can-do attitude, people looking out for each other, people looking after each other, and actually the fact that we've, we've been able to, to cope and we haven't been washed away by this pandemic is, is testament really to the staff and the whole organisation, but also to people at home. Ellen Pierce Lewis, White Lines. Sam 
Lara Jones, Gangs of London. Sarah Jones, his dark materials. Lara, I've got it, come on! The BAFTA Cymru Award for editing goes to Sarah Jones for Gangs of London. Diolch Bafta Cymru, I'm a Wobber Emma. Thanks Bafta Cymru for this award. I'd like to thank Sky, AMC, Pulse Films, Sister Pictures and Seven Screen and everybody who worked on Gangs of London Series 1. Um, big thanks to Assistant Editor Gareth Maybe, my agent Jessica Carney and my husband Tim. Um, the biggest thanks of all goes to Gareth Evans, a fantastic director and editor who I was so, so lucky to work with on this show. Diolch and Bawd, thank you very much. Thank you to my Hala and David. Now, am I Gavluna or Gobra Nessa? My Gavluna is in Gachir Hagwell to tell with. See then Amal Gadani or the Nidefra, Ne or the Hochar Joskinio, Dema Benaz, Achgar. Hello, Kroiso Benaz, how Hi, are Alex. you? I am, I'm good, how are you? Very well, thank you, you look stunning. Thank you very much. Um, now they tell me, and I can't believe it, that you've been at the BBC for 20 years. Yes, I can't believe it either. I started the year September the 11th happened, so I just had my 20 year anniversary. Oh my goodness, and has the food improved in the canteen? Well, it was good, then it got really bad, and now it's much, much better. You'll be in the good books now. You'll have helping, extra helping for saying that. Um, OK, I'll hand over to you for the next award. Thank you very much. Dioch, Alex. The next award is for presenters, sponsored by Deloitte. There are four outstanding presenters in this category. Ellen Fleer, Nathan Blake, Rod Gilbert and Richard Parks. Though I may add, perhaps there are two other presenters missed from the list. Let's take a look at the nominees. Ellen Fleer, Skurstan Achoir, Christopher Hughes. Pam o'n i'n wyth mwy ddoed? Paid. Yeah. Dwi'n mynd i'n siŵr ti'n cofio cwynsi ar y teledu. Ti'n cofio cwynsi. Um, oddo o'n medical examen yeah, 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 oddo. Yn gweithio mewn marw di yn fawr yn Los Angeles. A dwi'n cofio gwetsiad hwnna ac yn meddwl dwi eisiau bod yn cwynsi pan dwi wedi tyfu hynny. <laughs> <laughs> One of the other miners Norma mentioned... Nathan Blake, Wales' black miners. ...called Idris Phillips. Being a black person working in a coal mine in, in those days must have been quite a rarity. Yeah. Dad's famous saying was, we're all black underground. That's so right, yeah. yeah. That's yeah, what he always said. Absolutely. There's nobody, we're all black, we're all equal underground. That's yeah. 39. 35. Rod Gilbert, Rod Gilbert's work experience. Talk English. Sorry. If the octogenarian oligarch lost because of my accent, I'd definitely be sleeping with the fishes. 77. Now, 7, D7. 77. So the people that don't understand can understand that. They'll have their perceptions challenged of what Welsh is. Richard Parks in Richard Parks, Can I Be Welsh and Black? How would, how would you define yourself? I define myself as, as mixed race. My mum's white, my dad's, my dad's black. Um, it's as simple as that. I've never really shouted about either. Yeah, yeah. It's just who I am. And the BAFTA Cymru Award goes to Rod Gilbert for Rod Gilbert's work experience. Hi, BAFTA. Thank you very much. As you can see, we've come to wonderful Cannes to celebrate this award. Uh, very grateful. Uh, a lot of people to thank. Not much time. Thanks very much to the wonderful production crew, uh, BBC Wales for repeatedly commissioning this series, um, the Cardiff Council and the care community who allowed us in and made it happen. Most of all, of course, to the wonderful carers, uh, Kerry-Anne, Lizzie, Emma, the rest of the crew, 
who allowed us to highlight the wonderful job that they do. Uh, and their patients, Betty, Merv, Rocky, Anna, Neil, uh, Dave, everyone at College Fields Nursing Home, thank you very, very much. This means a lot to me, this one. My dad died in a care home shortly after we filmed this, and this is for carers everywhere. Thank you very much. Diolch Cheers. Congratulations to our winning presenter. The next award this evening is for News and Current Affairs, sponsored by IJPR. Let's take a look at the nominated programmes. We'll talk about this virus and saying, you know, it'll be Channel 4 News, Wales and the COVID-19 pandemic. And that quite clearly isn't always the case. And for all those families who have lost somebody, it, it can only be heartbreaking. I've just been a very, very lucky gentleman. Llyfryddiaeth Mike O'Leary. Pen Cadlis Heddly Dubbed Powys and Herverden. Marsadogion and Julia Troy Scythe Dig Tinetlo Rubel Afriv. Manun Julia Am Olion Dunnol. Menum Juliad Ilovrithieth. Heno in in travel to punk. Pow by Varn. Black Lives Matter. Hilieth. Do in die the brothoid at the Gunabi Lotta Hilieth and Bowed V. Hilieth and a skull gunrad, Ilchrad. The BAFTA Cymru Award for News and Current Affairs goes to Pawb I Van, Black Lives Matter. Oh my gosh, I'm going to say that Envaur, a Dioch Envaur y BAFTA and Amlog, am a Kutna Bidia Thorn, am Raglen, or the Gulagiga Mindy Power than Kermit Ran. Um, Hoffen Way Dioch Yes Pesorek, am Commissioner Raglen, Etonopolis, am Gun Herchi, a Hoffen Way Dioch Arbenegi, Nadine Richards, a Catherine Evans, my wife, Lou Mord Poisig, Ed Moyni Viga, she's seven feet in head, though he's annoyed. Um, I'd like to really dedicate this to black kids from down the country that don't necessarily always feel like there's a place for them on Welsh language media outlets. It's quite clear that, you know, we have stories to tell and people do want to listen. But yeah, how fun just go to the end of it all. We need to go to the end of it all. I've been going to be able to do it all. Do you know what I'm going to do? Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go to the end of it all. Now, we've reached the part of tonight's ceremony when we pay tribute to some of the friends and colleagues we've sadly lost in the past 12 months. Maggie and Vana, friend and William Nivi, a good course, Ninkidim Daimla, Artelio the Gid, a friend, I could wait for a my cochet. Now, here to present the next award is an actress from one of tonight's nominated films, Nuclear. She also plays Kinsey Locke in Netflix's hit supernatural drama, Locke and Key. A warm welcome to the brilliant Amelia Jones. Thank you. It's an honour to be part of tonight's show. 
The next award is for makeup and hair. Now, if there's one thing we all rely on in this industry, it's exceptional makeup artists and hairstylists. They can make a horror film more horrific, a period drama more authentic, and they can transform actors into a variety of convincing characters. Let's take a look at the nominee's work. Claire Williams, Gangs of London. It only took a second. No, son. It took a lot more. <laughs> Claire Pritchard Jones, Roald and Beatrix, The Tale of the Curious Mouse. Look at what's coming for you. No, I don't understand. <laughs> I can read leaves, can't I? See the future in your cup. <laughs> OK. Come on, then. Pass it over. Jacqueline Fowler, His Dark Materials. A witch's cloud pine. <laughs> is it true that within it is your ability to fly? ability to use magic. The BAFTA Cymru Award for Makeup and Hair goes to... Claire Pritchard-Jones for Roald and Beatrix, The Tale of the Curious Mouse. Thank you, BAFTA Cymru, Sky and Hartswood. And thank you, Elaine and David, for a lovely script and wonderful cast to work with. And of course, to my team, to James, Megan, Danny Marie, Lizzie and all our dailies that looked after our cast so well and kept smiling under their masks. Diolch. Llan gyfarchiadau and thank you, Amelia. Now, ni drwy yn sylw nawr at y categori actor. Nawr, gall actor da eich swyno a'ch denu chi mewn i stori a dal eich sylw tan y diwedd un. Whether they've taken you on a real-life journey or their performances are so terrifying they cause you to hide behind the sofa. Tonight's nominees have certainly created some of this year's most memorable moments. Dyma'r enwebiadau. Who's that? Callum Scott Howells as Colin Morris Jones in It's a Sin. Are they it's... We don't know. There's every single person die. Yeah, they do. I read your stuff. That's what it says. It says no one survives. Oh, Mommy, make them do something. I don't want to die. Evil, wicked. Keith Allen as John Monday Cooper Tuesday, in the Pembrokeshire Monday. Murders. I mean just that. I'm an innocent man. Take him down. This is not justice. This is persecution. Persecution of John Cooper. Carried out by Steve Brokings. A man is going to spend time in prison for a crime he did not commit. I am not a rapist. I am not a murderer. Mark Lewis Jones as Kinney Edwards in Gangs of London. <laughs> Far as you go. <laughs> Michael Sheen as Chris Tarrant in Quiz. And hold there! What did I? Oh, don't worry, no, 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 no. It's a lot less continuous magic than it is on the telly. Uh, lots of stops and starts. We've got a Mikey guest up now and put them in their scene. The audience, who have you brought? Uh, my wife. Uh, you better, actually. She's played before. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh. Hello. Again. The BAFTA Cymru Actor Award goes to... Callum Scott Howells as Colin Morris Jones in It's a Sin. Hello. Thank you so, so much, Bafta Cymru, for this amazing award. I've never won anything before, so I didn't even win anything at the school I stayed for, so this is amazing, um, especially for it to be a Bafta Cymru award as well. It's such an honour. And, of course, to be nominated alongside actors who have inspired me my, my whole life. 
Um, I'd like to say a massive thank you to the amazing Russell T Davis for taking a huge chance on me, to Nicola Schindler, Phil Collinson, our amazing, amazing director Peter Ho and everyone at Red Productions and of course my Pink Palace gang. Um, I'd like to thank my agents, everyone at Lou Coulson Associates, Emily Hargreaves, my beautiful, beautiful, beautiful family who I wouldn't be doing any of this without. And on behalf of me and my family, I'd like to dedicate this award to my Nana Pat and Bampi Brin. And also to the generation of artists and creatives that we lost to HIV and AIDS. The Ochen Vaud Bafta Cambri, the Ochen Vaud Yawn. Thank you. Hiang of Archiade. Now to Summinden Line at Inguabur Nessa. Save cover with your faith, y'all. And this award is sponsored by Cardiff Council. Our next presenter is a star of Bafta Cymru winning dramas The Left Behind and Keeping Faith and Channel 4's gripping drama Deceit. Christ of Cares is shown Daniel Young. Hello, Sean. Should I tell you? Hi, yeah, and Dear Alex. Dear Kamarun Katina, I need Henny. Bless you. Now, today, Gardner Shardam deceit. Achos of Colin Stag and Tippin o Gamariad. O then, what are all you need to be actor? De, I portrayed the Gamariad go young. O the then process hotlo what are all around paratoi. I'm a poison dog. Get a chara run go young. Poison hour. Yeah, poison hour. Um, on that, it's even high process again. So, I'm going to be blessed. I'm going to call Kevly chara run well, Colin. So I don't know if I challenge to my the actor. And sick it. At him, wish you never a project ever go. Ian, get you need a shard of Dano. I just come on and glue him Dano. And now, now, hundred just do it. It's a girl who's doing a job for us. Dear Alex. So the next award category is for director factual. My then we be on in a category of man adlu archi astode ang or ragleni faithful or ragleni dog ven nodwed dog veni single a chavresi faithful. Poor B in a story in a grew hadrod. Here are the nominations. Hannah Berryman, Rockfield, the studio on the farm. I saw the truth. I thought the roof was going to come off. Realise what we were doing. We didn't go. I know. Let's invent heavy metal. It just happens. Often people touch it without permission. Liana Stewart, black and Welsh. People just used to tug on my hair as if it wasn't attached to my head. So I just started doing it back, frankly. Uh, my hair looks short, but it's really long. My afro was a symbol of me coming out. Um, this is who I was. This is what I believed in. I didn't care what other people thought. Everybody's ventilated, everybody's unconscious. And Luke Pavey, critical you know, coronavirus in intensive care. People who are all unconscious, all on ventilators. And then as you walk through the different areas, there are just more and more and more people. So it's, it's really on an industrial scale, you know, it's, it's whole scale intensive care. Um, and that's something we've, we've never really been exposed to before. Nia Dryhurst, Drich, Chwair Vach, Chwair Vach. Chwair Vach, Chwair Vach. Chwair Vach, Chwair Vach, and well. Rhoedd anill dwy i siwt rio trwsio am perthynas. Perthynas i'n mynd i bod yn gret ers i chi nos adal y fyddyn ac MI6. Ond ar ôl y sesiwn therapy cyntaf, dwi'n teimlo bod ni'n cymryd cam am nôl yn hytrach na cam am lain. Mae'r wobr Cymru BAFTA yn mynd i Liana Stewart for Black and Welsh. I never ever thought I'd get nominated for an award, so to win, I just want to thank everyone who took part in Black and Welsh. You were the representation we needed here in Wales, so thank you from the bottom of my heart. I want to thank the crew, I want to thank my partner, my friends, the Soka police, my whole family, especially my mum Bonnie and my sister Saz. I love you so much. Um, I want to thank Butown because without you I wouldn't be who I am today. So, Jalkumbao Bafta, thank you so much. Llong gyfarchiadau. Dwi hefyd yn cael y rhan rydedd o gyflwyno'r wobr nesaf sydd ar gyfer y categori torri trwodd, wedi ei noddi gan Creative Wales. This award recognises some of the most exciting, emerging talent who are making their way up the ranks of the film and television industry right now. And we look forward to seeing more from these hugely talented people in the future. 
จะมาแรนมวยเปียจ้ะเอ็นคีวะคันอวัยน์ producer on the Welshman because of my previous uh, experiences and my uh, <laughs> reputation they call it during the past few years I was targeted by the secret service as a danger I'm Kath Pendleton James Ponton director on the Merthyr Mermaid 48 years old Mama too. And believe it or not, I'm going to swim a mile in the coldest place on Earth, Antarctica. On the night of May the 23rd, 1970, it caught fire. Michael Kendrick Williams, producer on Britannia's Burning, Fire on the Bridge. Oh, great i n g inferno! Yeah, yeah. It was devastating. Oh, horrendous. It was uh, horrendous. Yeah. Scary. Who would have thought, you know, a few sparks and smoke would have uh, had such an awful effect? a r e n i t h i t h is Michael Kendrick Williams, producer on Britannia's Burning, Fire on the Bridge. Britannia, Tan Arabont. Diolch o galon basta am y wobr yma yn i byth i'n meddwl sy'n i'n ymwneud â'r islam yma yn... Um, I mean, p r o b a b l amazing g r a d a r Bear Gun, Popoli Raid, and Dana Tan, the o c h a g a l a n i Crew, i g i d Paul Andrew, e t h i n Floyd, s h a n o w e n Pope, and Weaver Horn, n e v e r y o t h e amazing, and Kinney, the Beth Moore, how do we? The o c h a g a l a n i b e t u r i s and with the c o v e r l i v e with your mom, I'm Hugh r u s s e l a t h e o c h a g a l a n s w i n e s p e d r a c a Christina m c c a u l l y and BBC Wales, and b e t e r Duchin, p a r m o u t h b e t u r Raid, the c o v e r l i v e with your mom, I'm Hugh r u s s e l the o c h a g a l Dear Sean, and congratulations to our breakthrough winner. Now, for many of us, trying to achieve good lighting involves a trip to IKEA and bringing home 10 lamps, 100 tea lights, and a pack of Swedish meatballs. Thankfully, the talent in the next category are more experienced in such matters. Here are the nominees for photography and lighting fiction. There was no hot evidence. Baz Irvine, no the Pembrokeshire evidence. murders. He's waiting for us to find, ma'am. Thanks to Huntsman and the original investigations, we have access to over 3,000 exhibits in storage. That's a potential treasure trove of victim and perpetrator DNA. At the time of Huntsman, the science wasn't up to scratch on age-degraded trace DNA, but as we know, things have come a long way since. John Conroy, Roald and Beatrix, The Tale so, of the Curious Mouse. What do you think? Well, let me be totally honest with you. I think it's divine. Matt Flannery, Gangs of London. m i l o s Moore, Industry. And the BAFTA Cymru Award goes to Matt Flannery for Gangs of London. Sponsored by Urban Myth Films, the next award is for actress, and the selection of talent on offer this evening is breathtaking. We've got a no-nonsense detective hunting a killer, a headmistress of a Nazi school for girls, a hospice nurse who forges a relationship with God, and a real-life former midwife who delivered a dazzling performance in one of this year's most popular dramas.
Yma i gyflwyno Robert, mae actor o gyrdydd sydd wedi cyfnewid bod yn asiant gyda'r KGB am rôl fel yr ymchwilydd preifat iconic Perry Mason. Mi gafodd ei enwebu ar gyfer BAFTA Cymru am ei rôl yn y ddrama dyledu lwyddiannus Death and Nightingales, a sydd hefyd wedi derbyn gwobr Sian Phillips am ei gyfraniad sylweddol i ffilm a thyledu. He might be living the American dream in New York, but he'll always be a Cardiff boy at heart. It's the wonderful Matthew Rees. Mae hi'n frain o'r mwyaf i fod yma i ddathlu perfformiad e eithriadol y bedair actores yma. Mae gallu i ymgolli ei hun yn llwyr o fewn i cymeriadau yn dist i'w gwaith grenis ei hymroddiad a'u talent anghyffredin. These remarkably gifted women really do represent some of the biggest and brightest talent to shine on our screens this year. Dyma renwybiadau. Alexandria Riley as D.I. Ella Richards in the Pembrokeshire Murders. Justin Hall, free stop. Your first conviction for burglary. That your idea of grafting, John? I don't like your tone. Service. Andrea Doherty as Eileen Morris Jones in It's a Sin. My nan and my great grandmother, and they said no. They said absolutely not. They said their staff didn't think it was safe to handle a body with AIDS. Yeah. The man in charge, I've known him for 35 years, and he said no. He said, uh, try Cardiff. So I tried Cardiff. The man that I said, it might be possible, but the cremation would have to be done at the very end of the day. Ilsa was on the reserve team for the Berlin Olympics, you know. Dame Judi Dench as Miss Rochel in Six Minutes to Midnight. I have her back. Their Morgan Schwimmen is about as much of England as they'll ever see. I like to protect the girls from the world outside. They never venture out these days. England can be an unforgiving place if you happen to be German. Morvid Clark as Maud in St. Maud. Ar ynillydd Morvid Clark as Maud in St. Maud. Thank you so much for this award, Bafta Cymru. Um, it was an absolute pleasure to play the part of um, Maud and be in Rose's film and work with an amazing crew, people like Ben and Tina and Paulina and Oliver and Andrea. Um, thank you to Studio Canal for getting the film out in a very difficult time and um, being wonderful support and to Kate, Izzy and Abby. Congratulations to our winning actress, Adi Elchenvaur Matthew. Right then, now is the time you might want to get out a notebook. Or, if you're one of those tech-savvy people, the Notes app on your phone, as we share the second of tonight's Welsh industry films. This one is jam-packed with sneaky peeks and exclusive snippets from programmes and films which you'll kick yourself for missing. So save yourself the hassle and set yourself a reminder as we view these exciting upcoming titles. Mwynhewch. This place holds so many memories for so many people in this town. And they're the ones who get behind you. You're joking. They say they're walking into like a Wes Anderson movie. What a compliment, eh? Hey, Bob, I'm not sure what's going on there. Can you open your mouth wide for me, Bob? <laughs> Horror is already out there in all of us. Okay, I've made a mental note. 
star of stage and screen, our next guest is joining us remotely because, quite frankly, he's so busy, he's barely got time to make a cup of tea. He's appeared in hit series and films, including Gangs of London, His Dark Materials, His House and Humans. It's Shope Dirisu. <laughs> but there's always time to present an award for BAFTA Cymru. And it's my pleasure to announce the winner of the Short Film Award. A good short film can highlight the talents of great writing, directing and producing and engage its audience in a variety of diverse subjects and genres. And tonight's nominees are no exception. Let's take a look at their work. I'm just really happy for you. Father of the Bride. Sorry, everyone, we'll be back in just a minute. I choose. Is the squirrel's nest. The nest. Squirrel's nest is, is a bunch of men having great fun uh, playing with words. And we will talk about anything and everything. No subject is taboo. We will talk about it. Usually over a cup of tea and some biscuits. They can either drink coffee all day or they can do a bit of woodwork. You no, know, and um, help each other out, basically. The Welshman. And I him go to a, to a kiosk. He's making a call, and as he made the call, he looks slightly round. I knew then by his look, you know, you get to know these things. You know. Yeah, he was definitely working in secret service. And the BAFTA Cymru Award goes to The Welshman. I want to start by thanking all the independent cinemas and art centres across Wales for showing this film. Thank you to Callum Glass, Ben Jones, Lester Hughes and Oshan Griffith for helping me tell this story. David Realton, thank you for your soundtrack. It is absolutely stunning. Thank you for your hard work and your friendship. And Owain, thank you for being my partner in crime, for putting up with me for two years editing this film. Your patience and encouragement deserves a BAFTA alone. I love you. Eva Vachan. Thank you for helping me waft that smoke and chase the ferry. You're a star, you're beautiful. Mum and Dad, thank you for always encouraging creativity. Thank you for putting me through film school. I love you. I'm the luckiest daughter in the world to have you both. Dielchi Bafta, this just goes to show you can make something out of nothing. No budget, go and make some films. There are just three more awards to go, and the next is for costume design. Now, gallech chi fyth gymryd y gref sy'n mynd i ddylunio gwisg yn gan i'y taol, gan ei fod yn rhan o natod o gynhyrchiad. It can complete a character for the actors and lend authenticity for the viewers. The costume designer's research and expertise means that you won't see a top hat on your screens before 1790, a miniskirt before the swing in 60s, or a digital watch at the Battle of Hastings. Gydewch chi'n edrych ar ai'r talent y dylunio sydd wedi ein webu ar gyfer gwobr BAFTA Cymru heno. Caroline McCall, His Dark Materials. We are live in Pembrokeshire where there have been dramatic... Dawn Thomas Mondo, The Pembrokeshire Murders. Crimes. The murders of Richard and Helen Thomas and Peter and Gwenda Dixon. And now, decades on, these two double murders are being reinvestigated. Detective Superintendent Steve Wilkins is the man leading this reinvestigation. Lucinda Wright, Six Minutes to Midnight. Oh, 
Sarah Arthur, a discovery of witches. I hear that you are the owner of a curious work by Hieronymus Bosch. You did. Uh, Your Majesty, I, in my haste to be admitted to your presence, I, I fear there has been some miscommunication. The BAFTA Cymru Award for Costume Design goes to Caroline McCall for his dark materials. Caroline? Yes? We've won. Really? Thank you, Welsh BAFTA. Thank you to my incredibly hardworking and talented team and all the crew of HDM who bring these worlds to life. Dioch. So the penultimate award this evening is for Director Fiction, sponsored by Champagne Tattinger. Now, directors are the driving force of any production, and tonight's nominees are exceptional in their field. Let's take a look at their work. <laughs> Ashley Way, White Lines. She's staying there for a few days. I've been listening to loads of Axel's tracks that I've never heard before. Marcus has got everything back from the Manchester days. Gareth Evans, Gangs of London. You keep saying John Jones. We hunt together. Something you call love, but confess. You've been a messin' where you shouldn't have been a messin'. Oh, and I'm so sorry about this, sweetie bee. Mark Evans, The Pembrokeshire Murders. Jesus Christ, they are khaki, but they do look a lot shorter. Maybe you had them altered. Ar an ichyddiw, Mark Evans for the Pembrokeshire Murders. Diolch yn after Cymru. I'm very proud of the work we all did on Pembrokeshire Murders. Thank you, Simon Heath at World, for inviting me in. Diolch, thank you, Ed Talvan at Seven, for being such a great supporter and friend throughout the project. And to Nick Stevens for a wonderful script and to a great cast and crew. Special thanks though to Steve Wilkins and to Jonathan Hill for allowing us to tell their story and for being such great champions and guardians of the real people involved in the real victims. So, thank you. Now, to most people, dust is nothing but a trigger for an allergic reaction or a reminder to clean the house. But for our next presenter, dust or dark matter is an elementary particle associated with consciousness and leads to all sorts of mysteries. Who would have thought, eh? Dragging himself away from dusty spaces and here to present our final award is the actor who plays Will Parry in his dark materials, the very talented Ami Wilson. Hello, Kreisamawr. Hello. No, lovely to meet you. How are you? Lovely to meet you too. I'm very well, thank you. Um, congratulations thank on you. His Dark Materials. It must be superb to be part of the cast. Um, I feel so honoured to be working with so many good actors and actresses um, and amazing crew members as well. It's an honour. Well, no pressure, but you're here to present the final award of the evening. I'm sure you'll smash it. I'm feeling the pressure. Over to you. <laughs> So we've come to the final award for this evening, which is for feature television and film. Nominees in this category include a documentary about a legendary recording studio in Wales, a psychological drama which follows a sister fleeing her violent brother, and a romantic drama about a woman with schizophrenia who encounters new sources of love and life. Let's take a look at the nominees. Eternal Beauty. I must follow you. Ever since you touch my hand, I know that near you I always must be, and nothing can keep you from me. You are my destiny. Brother. 
nuclear. Trouble with being at Rest Extra Studios for a long period of time. Rockfield, the studio on the farm. It starts to get a bit edgy. Bands are either a tight knit unit or they fall apart. A bit like families, isn't it? Because I because I don't play any instruments, you know what I mean? A lot of the like, the, of all the rest of the band played instruments. I'd sort of do my singing and I'd be sort of bored, you know what I mean? The BAFTA Comrie Award goes to Eternal Beauty. Thank you so much, BAFTA Cymru. This award means so much. Um, we really appreciate that people, you know, get the movie and understand it. And yeah, this means the world. I'd like to give a big shout out to our crew who were incredible and very, very special and talented. We're very fortunate to work with them and our amazing cast. And also a, a quick shout out to Sally Hawkins for being the best actor in the world and for really going there with us. Yeah, thank you, BAFTA. Um, it really is a huge honour. Um, we, we really are grateful. Um, but I also have to give a virtual... Huge thank you to the BFI who have supported us uh, throughout the process of making Eternal Beauty, uh, to Film Cymru who have been there for us throughout, and Welsh Government who, without their support, we simply wouldn't have made this film. Um, lastly, big, big thank you to all those at Cliff Edge Pictures in Cardiff. Thank you. This, uh, this award is for the person that the movie is based on, so uh, thank you very much The Real Calamity Jane. Diolch and congratulations to our feature television film winner. Well, sadly, we've come to the end of the 30th British Academy Cymru Awards. Llong gyfarchiad y mawr i'n hynnychwyr ac i'r holl yn webion, a diolch hefyd i bawb fi'n rhan o'r noson. A big diolch yn fawr to our category sponsors and official partners for supporting us in bringing the show to you. Aquapana, BBC Cymru Wales, Cardiff Council, Champagne Tattinger, Channel 4, Corey & Co, Qbox, Cowine, Mentor a Business, Decade 10, Deloitte, Eric James Transport Services, Facilities by ADF, Gorilla, Hugh James Solicitors, IJPR, ITV Cymru Wales, Esperarec, San Pellegrino, Sugar Creative, Trossol, Urban Myth Films, Villa Maria and funding and support from Welsh Government via Creative Wales. And thank you to all of you for watching wherever you may be. Well, no glamorous after party again for me this year, but Helen Gwyn and Airy Thomas have invited me out for the night. They've asked me to bring a shovel and a pair of wellies. Should be interesting. No star. <laughs>